between Thug Rose Namajunas and Joanna Yelmjajek. And it ended with me saying exactly that. Can you do it? The Rose, My not God. as well. But for Joanna here, Jacek, she wanted this rematch, this third meeting, so badly because she still believes, without a shadow of a doubt, that she's better than Rose. Now. She thinks she's the best fighter in this division, the best draw weight in the world. And no matter how many times she gets beat, that thought will never change. Big kick land. Body keep playing. Well, it's one thing to be confident in your chin. It's another thing to leave your head wide open for damage, and that's exactly what she did there as she eats the uppercut. Let's see if she circles out and tries to prevent any further damage here. Mixes it up nicely in terms of staying heavy and also staying active. Oh, she's looking to set up that head kick. No good. Nama Yunus gets caught with that punch. Don't be afraid to get that head off the center line. 25 total strikes have now landed for Rose Namajunas. Oh, the right hand is there for oh! oh, she might be in trouble now. Huge diving punch to the head. Can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. Big right hook attempt, but she misses. Left hand punch to the clinch. Real sneaky body kick. Oh, well, look at her crack with that uppercut. She's got a great jab, some nice hooks, but she likes that uppercut too. And that's why it's so effective, John. As you said, it comes off the hook. It comes off the jab. So when you expect a right hand off a jab, nope, she's throwing uppercut. When you expect a straight right off a hook, nope, she's throwing uppercut. So as you try to avoid that straight punch, the one is coming right up the middle. What a performance by this young lady. in the clinch. Man, her head is just getting snapped back like a turtle. Beautiful combination once again, and she just hasn't been able to adjust. Striking defense should not be employed by getting punched in the face. She has to move her head, keep her hands up to avoid taking all these clean shots. Big. Eventually, she will turn this defense into... Oh! What a round. All right, so a standing ovation from this capacity crowd after that round. A huge knockdown there in the middle of the round. Got to have her feeling pretty good here as she goes to the store. Back and forth up to that point, but she eventually found the shot that put her opponent on her backside. But how about the toughness? of oh. the opponent to get up off the floor and finish that round. Let's see how she approaches the next round. All right, here we go, folks. The start of round right. two. Thug Rose Namajunas. Right. And the inimitable Yolanda Yonjic. Oh, she works the body as well as anybody in this division. Another strike there, and these shots are really going to take their toll as this fight moves on. Forget the turtle and that kick. Take down lands for. Oh, well played there as she gets back to her feet. Because this fight is about done. 
So 67 total strikes have now landed for Rose Namajunas. And landing with 47% accuracy against Joanna Yonjic. All right, well, if you've been watching, you know her uppercut has been absolutely on point here tonight, DC. No reason to think she won't get right back to it. No, she needs to go right back to doing it. It's working. She's very good. Oh! She is such a diverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's going to finish the Big knee to the body! Circling towards the left. Connection fire there. Lower the curtain. Bring the cast out. Bring the cast out. Take the foul. The uh -huh. night's over. All right, she postures up here, DC. We'll see if she can get those ground strikes. Here. Watch for the huge elbows that she's known for. Back to the feet now. Again, they will clinch here. Big punch from the clinch. Oh! You can never know what you're gonna see with this young lady. Is she gonna finish the fight? Oh! Well, she was a little bit hesitant in round oh. Can't take pictures now. She has to react. She has to go chase the finish. Oh! There are a few things more fun to watch in mixed martial arts than these type of transitions and scrambles on the ground. High-level grappling can really be entertaining. Oh! She is such a reverse striker that that big strike landed, and it looks like she's gonna finish his fight. Somehow she survives and advances after getting knocked down with a big punch there in that round. She's tough. She's durable. But she cannot continue to take strikes like this. She needs to move her head on the center line. She cannot be a stationary target if she has any desire to win this fight. Still round underway. What a punch. And just like that, the fight is over. Holy smokes. What a performance. Yeah, that was just a beautiful shot by her there to end the fight. I'm not sure she could have drawn it up in midway through the round. I'm not even sure her opponent saw it coming. So big, big knockout win for her here tonight. Well, that's a knockout they'll be talking about for quite some time. What a moment for this fighter here tonight. We get the official decision with Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, Buffett. the referee, Dan Bugliano, has called a stop to this contest at 10 seconds of the third round. Declaring the winner by knockout, Thug Rose Narayuna! Well, there she is, and you can be sure there's going to be a long line at the after party tonight after what she was able to accomplish tonight. I mean, she will be as popular tonight as she's ever been because no one forgets a knockout like this. It'll be on TV. It'll be on the news. It'll be available everywhere she turns for the next few weeks, and this is a massive moment for her.